It's me again. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Hello, beautiful people, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, it's your girl again, Gloria. Well, today, just like you have seen from the title, I have 10, 10 beautiful hacks for you girls. My ladies, well, if you haven't subscribed, you already know the drill. Click on that subscribe button before you continue this video. In fact, what are you even doing? Before you leave this channel, make sure you subscribe. Click on that subscribe button, okay? And then there's a little bell just beside the subscribe button. Click on that as well. Because when you do that, you'll be the first person to know when I post a video, okay? So uh, we're going to jump right into this video. So um, don't ramble too much. So first things first. So most of you already know this Garnier, Garnier Skin Active um, Cleansing Water. Most of us use it for our makeup removal. It's really good, trust me. You need to have one pair of it. But the first the first hack i have for you today now is the ganyan water and your baby wipes the ganyan water is used to uh, re-wet your dried baby wipes so most of us when our, our wipes are dry we just pass it out in the bin now when you have this what you do all you do is pour some of the cleansing water in the dried wipes and just allow it sit in and spread out with wipes, it's really easy. It just spreads out so quickly. Now look at this, guys. All wet again and soft. Mothers, specifically mothers, these wipes are not supposed to be used for your baby's bum or cleaning your baby up. This is specifically my makeup wipes. And that's why I use this, this um, cleansing water to be wet my makeup yeah, so for those of you who use makeup wipes, because it's literally the fastest for me, yeah. I can't, the wipes is literally beside me here, and I just get this easy, easy, quick, quick. Okay, so mothers, be careful. Do not re wet your baby's, um, do not re wet your baby's wipe with this because it's a cleansing water. I don't, I think the chemicals are not going to be good for your um, baby's bum, and also because, um, this one is the hack for the mothers because you're not supposed to be using scented wipes for your child um, because they could get it, they already have sensitive skin so they could react to it so no no for babies so the good thing about it is if your baby's wipe is already dried the one you use for your baby that's what I mean you can get it wet it and then use it personally as your makeup wipes no longer for your baby okay you do not want your baby getting all reacted to this girls Personally for me, yeah, I sweat a lot, yeah, and this summer, you know, if you're not careful, you'd be sweating like a pig, <laughs> trust me, and then you do not want those, you know, body odor or, it's not like you do not even use um, deodorant or something, but they do not last long, you know, men's deodorant, girls, men's deodorant, they work like magic, they last long as well, so I have two here that I'm going to show you. So it's not like um, the other ones are not good, but personally, this is the ones I use. So the first one I'll be um, showing you guys is the Lynx Antiperspirant Dry Protection, 48 hours. So there are other types of Lynx here. I have other collections because right now, yeah, the secret. My husband is done is he's fed up of me using his deodorant so when he goes to the shop he makes sure he has to buy two man's gotta buy two you know because lynx is really good it lasts long and it smells really good too the other one as well that i have is the nivea men the black the black and white um nivea men invisible original and it's quick dry it just pss, pss, pss. And well, but I don't do pss, pss, pss. I do about like three of it because it lasts long. People that use insufficient amounts of antiperspirant. I am talking to all you people that are trying to make your can of deodorant last two months. So you're giving it a quick pss, pss, under each armpit. No, it's too hot for that, all right? Free up the spray. Give it a good three second spray under each armpit. Press down on the nozzle. You people that are doing a quick 0.5 seconds and then wondering why your armpit is kung fu fighting by midday. What are you scared of? Long as well, so because it lasts long as well, so I go pss, 
<laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah, so the Nivea men and the links, they work really good. You know, personally, this is what I use. I mean, you can use something else. I've got men's the other one that I do not know about, but this is what my husband uses this too, and so I use it. They have other Nivea as well that I use, but um, he mostly buys this one and the blue if you know the blue one um, I don't have it here but the white and blue the white and black one yeah so really good it lasts long and also it um you know it just stays dry you know it just it stays dry for those of you who do not sweat as much as I do yeah so it stays dry anyway on to the next hack clean your setting spray on your highlighter that's my next hack so how does this work um I'm just going to show you demonstration. So get your brush and you just you spray all of that. You can either do it you, you you can either do it on it first before you spray or spray then you use this. So whichever one works. So you can either um spray the brush first then use the highlighter or use the highlighter first and then spray the brush so whichever one works for you is also good so guys do you see that oh my days <laughs> when you do this here yeah, people are gonna find you in the dark you know blend it or whatever well this can this kind of glow your enemies could even go blind to do the other side so it doesn't look like I'm having it on just one end. Look at that, guys. Okay, so ignore the fact that I'm shining so much, but you already know what I mean. You just need to blend all of that, okay? So, yeah. Look at that glow, guys. Okay. Um, It's not only gonna, you know, appear really nicely on your face but it's also gonna last long you get me so now on to the next see oil or vaseline or coconut oil whatever you have for a lot long lasting perfume i think most of you lost you know this already anyway so i'm gonna be using vaseline today i have coconut oil but i'm gonna be using where you want to spray your perfume the most and where you want it to last Yeah, doing this yeah, it smells sweet all day long. Yeah, trust me. So it's really, it's really good. It will last longer than you would expect it to. So my other next hack would be um, using a same Vaseline or coconut oil. If you've seen my previous um, video of my natural um, makeup remover, you'll see that I used the Vaseline coconut oil and you know other ones. I'll put the link down on the description box below so you can uh, check it out using the vaseline to clean a dried liquid lipstick so I personally do not have any dried liquid lipstick so i'm not going to be demonstrating that for you guys on to my next beauty hack guys so it's going to be a diy lip scrub you can use sugar honey and lemon whatever you have so at the moment i've only got sugar and coconut oil but if you got honey mix that up coconut oil in here sugar mix that up for you mix mix so my one could be a bit light so you can add more sugar if you want. Just For my next beauty hacks guys, it's gonna be using a panty liner. I'm sure um every girl has one panty liner or the other. I have three purples for this. Um, panty liner but the first one we're going to use today will be using the panty liner as an eyeshadow shield the second one will be using a panty liner on your top literally literally in your armpit to absorb sweat then the third one which is quite similar to the second one is putting the same panty liner excuse me for those of you who always sweat under the boobs you want to cut out this part that's usually rounded so this part that's usually rounded is where you want to cut out if it's for your bra or for your um um arm hole you can cut it into two but for your eyeshadow shield you have to use the rounded edges 
so for that ham or one for like t-shirt because you do not want to see any um sweat marks yeah so it literally absorbs the sweat so the part that sticks so the part that sticks is where you stick to your top so you literally just stick it you can stick it all here or here depending on how like the cut of your um shirt just put it there and no one will even notice because it has a sticky part it just sticks there the same goes for, goes for the bra you want to put this too at the rounded edge of your bra where you usually sweat the most and just glue it there and it literally just absorbs all of that moisture all of that sweat that would naturally create an odor for the eyeshadow shield you do is pin at the back you just do that ignore me if i look funny but yeah i go i've got an eyeshadow stick here what is It literally traps all of that. It traps all of the eyeshadow that was supposed to literally go on your face. So some people who do the eyeshadow before the whole makeup, yeah. So that that way you can just wipe it off. But if you are the type that you already do your makeup and then you apply the eyeshadow, then really nice. So for the part where it literally you tape to your skin, you can literally just you know brush it, brush it all again, blend everything up. Yeah. So my next beauty hack for you guys. I'll show you so this is what I've got so this is what I've got here with me you can find um, some of them when you're looking for it yeah it, it gets really difficult and we all know the struggle of finding these little bands because as because there are so many the more reason they could be anywhere but this is the lifesaver you can use any of your shower curtains um, there's some that actually locks that like you can hear it pins. I think this one just you tighten it, yeah. So what you do is put that. I've got one here already. Voila. See that? And you can literally just hang it in anywhere in your um beauty room, in your bathroom. Just hang it somewhere that has like a nail or something. And then you need one. You can just take it out that way you also know where you put all of them because they all be in one place a tic tac container for holding your pins your baby pins um bobby pins wherever pin possible you know where they all are once one is lost one is gone portable anywhere you know you can put it in your makeup bag in your nursery bag for mothers and all you have to do is you either get one of each or one of this one which is really easy really doable and as well it's convenient so my darlings thank you for watching and staying tuned i'll see you guys in my next video i hope you enjoyed all of these hacks and learned one or two these are all hacks that we all need to know and do at least if you're not doing about two of them at least do eight okay so um i'll see you guys in my next video ciao